Welcome everyone, we are two weeks out from Apocalypse, of course, I am the original, the greatness himself, Chad Epic, remember that name because I guarantee you'll be screaming it later, and next to me of course is the Celtic Relic, Matt Bishop, how are you doing tonight? Well, I'm hanging in there, Chaz, and uh, I'm glad you're wearing deodorant today because it is hot as Hades. However, that don't matter. We got a big card, big show, so let's take it to the Penguin Patrol and get it started. In layman's turn, take it to Pete. Yeah, Chaz. Welcome to WAW Wrestling Aftermath. <laughs> now, please give a warm welcome to the WAW President, Moody Star. Oh boy. I'll give a warm welcome, all right. We are going to talk about the kind of welcome you'll give her. I wonder what pearls of wisdom we'll be hearing from El Presidente, acting Presidente, Moody Star, and. Oh, God. Hey, wait a minute. I'm on the back of this book. I didn't read her book, I didn't like her book. That is false advertising. Good evening. Oh, people, people, thank you for coming tonight. Just get a look at this. <laughs> oh, but seriously, apocalypse, two weeks away. Yes, thank you. I don't need an echo. Anyway, if this year's apocalypse is anything like Apox of the previous years, you can expect this year to be just as tumultuous and just as hot. And speaking of apocalypses held in previous years, you can read all about the backstage drama right in my book, Shining Star, How I Made It as the Queen of WAW, available August 27th. Thank you. Thank you. So this year, at Apocalypse 2010, August 27th, 2011, 2011, somebody edit that, would ya? You're gonna see your champion, Troy Barbo. Yeah, there we go. Defending the title against Michael James. You're going to see the Firebirds, a team of a lot of style. Well, what do they got? There you go. Yeah, whatever. You're going to see the Apocalypse Finals. Rocco versus Carnage. I must say, Carnage has not fared very well in Apocalypses in previous years. No. You will see the Vixen title, often referred to as my title, the Moody Star Vixens Championship. No. The current champion, Bianca Wild, will be defending. I'll give her her props. Go ahead, clap. She's so Defending against Serena Morrissey. You will see the multi-team battle roll. And you will see uh, probably Sage beating up Moose. Moose beating up Sage. Something like that. Thank you, boy. Anyway, speaking of, I would just like to first welcome out somebody who has recently become a bit of a first in WAW, bring out our new WAW Cure Champ, Andreas Reyes. Well, here comes Andreas Reyes, the new Pure Champion of WAW. Hard earned, hard fought, and well deserved. Took down that mountain of lard, I guess. Butter, otherwise known as Sage the Rolo. Say, uh, and enjoy his victory. Andreas Reyes is the first minority to ever to win a championship in WAW. So maybe we'll start calling the pure Arican champion. Does that work? Oh, Chaz. Sit yourself down before you hurt yourself. Who knows? Maybe we'll see some oranges strapped to the belt. Hey. You gotta say, felt pretty good making history last week. I became the first minority to win any gold here in WAW. Accomplishment I am very proud of. Now, I'm in my two week title reservation period and I don't know who I'm facing. 
to defend my Beer Wrestling Championship. So, I don't know, do you have any ideas? That's actually why I called you out here, Andreas. We have some options, and I made a bit of a list. Um, but let's see. It's not going to be Johnny Psycho because he took a walk again. He'll be back. Yeah, he'll be back. And yeah, it's not going to be Sage. He's, I don't know, doing something else. So, I mean, we have a few options for you. Could be Chris Shady. Well, cool beans. I mean, Chris Shady. I'm down with that. I'm down with whoever. It really doesn't matter. Now, does it? I'm ready to go against whoever. And no matter what, I'm going to come out on top. Come two weeks at Apocalypse. And if you didn't know, now you know. This is what makes me. This is what I live here. Speak of the devil. Not looking too happy either. Now the fact is that is Chris Shady's ring. You will hear right in your mouth in one of the worst promos I've ever heard in my life. Congratulations, you won the pure title. I've done that. I've done everything it does in W A W. And if I want that belt back at Apocalypse, I'll take it. And WAW will stand for what it should stand for. We are white. Whoa. Oh. Uh, boo, boo. Yeah. Hey. All you stupid little kids, once you grow up, you'll realize how awesome I am. Yeah, I just said that. So watch you try stealing another catchphrase. You got that tough guy? Don't hate me because you Olay, Olay, Olay. Olay. Well, if they're talking about hate, nobody hates Chris Shady more than this man. Oh, let's go. Freaking black. Hall of Famer, yeah. but where were you 
Where were you when people were looking to challenge Psycho? Oh, you! You were scrubbing out to the goat boy over here! Oh, I don't like I'm the only one! Psycho came to me! Because he wanted the best life that you had! He didn't go to you! Because he know he did shit from you! He went to you because you're washed up and he wanted to give you your last moment! Washed up? You couldn't even be quiet if you tried! Any day! Any day! Any time! 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 Say you're gonna be the next pure champion. Okay, I've been here, done that, you know, and I lost my chance to be in the WWE. Yeah, do that. Shut up. Okay, I lost my chance to win the Apocalypse Tournament due to that stupid caveman. So now, as you all know, I am protesting, protesting Hellbound. That is the worst type of wrestling this side of the planet. Now, if I if I can win this pure title again, I can bring it back to where it used to be. To where it's supposed to be. Just start your countdown, and a whole bunch of you will be back here before you can say, Um, Bob Duras? Really? All right, Chris Shady, I can see. Fox, I can see. Awesome, fine, I can see. Alex Shady, sure. Fuck? Well, he's the WAW resident Jedi. He uses the fork. Charles, leave the comedy to the Bears. Why don't you fuck off? I have a question. <laughs> um, this is a big mistake. I leaned on the console back there with all the knobs. My music started playing. It's embarrassing. Um, so, I'm sorry guys, I'll, It's alright, exit that way, have a good night. Alright, see you guys. What? You know what? Since you guys are all here, um, I come, we have like six up here. That's even teams, right? I should stick around. I should stick around. I don't know about Bartlow's, but right now, I'm... Ready to go. Alright! Since all of you came out on purpose or not, here's how it's gonna be at APOP. What, six of us? Yes, Flats. For the pure title, Andreas Reyes defends his title against freaking Flax. Alex Chase came out here to wrestle. Well, he doesn't have a choice. The, bo the boss says, you're in the ring. Get in the ring. Oh, this is the kind of respect a guy like Alex Chase gets around here, all right? He busts his hump all his time, and what happens? 
He's told the rest of the one they want him to. I mean, what kind of respect is that right there? How about the kind of respect that you're, pay you're working for pay, you're here to wrestle, and you know what? You get your butt in the ring. However, I think, right. this I think this match is getting ready to go before Pete rings the bell. Two weeks before the end of the world, two weeks before Apocalypse. And what we have right here is a preview to the six-man tagging, which is a uh, little flashback, actually. Two years ago, the first very first... Uh, Defense was a two uh, six man tag in. All right, so this will be like the rapture before the actual apocalypse or something. Well, no, next week will be the rapture. Oh, okay. This is the pre rapture before the apocalypse. Pre rapture. This is the night actually Ron Duran ran Savage Guys. Oh, that's right, before he returns and elbow drops evil to, to the pits of hell. Exactly, okay. so we, uh, we got a six man. All right, well, everybody's ready to roll here, and it looks like we got oh, a lot of oh. We got Flax heading after Shady, and of course, oh, we got Alex Chase. Trading blows with uh, Andreas, who surprisingly. Hey, man. All right, team. Well. Arkham, wait a minute. Oh, yeah. oh. Baseball slides all no. three of them simultaneously miss. Oh, kick to the head, thrown to the brutality wall. Oh, uh, if this is any indication, Apocalypse is going to be the end of the world. We got a wall out here. Well, all I'm like six a men. I'm oh, like no. a Wait a minute. Oh, God. Incoming. Oh, oh Vintage Johnny Psycho. And oh, big slam. Oh, wait a minute. What oh, is. God. Oh, God! Oh, kick to the bread basket. Oh, my God. Well, well that's uh, that's how he does. That's a little uh, insult to injury to uh, Andreas Reyes towards his former partner, Adu. Well, unfortunately, he's in Puerto up. Rico selling oranges, I heard. You know what, Chaz? No, I'm serious. He really is in Puerto Rico selling oranges. Seriously? Yes, and he, he works at the Home Depot. Oh, well, This I'm isn't me being hey, food. This is true. The, focus on the match. We got Andreas Reyes going up against Chris Shady here, who's going to work. And again, Chris Shady, a former pure champion himself, grand slam champion. Unfortunately, he could use a slam on the head. Maybe take that knock that block, tr chip off you know, the block. You, you want to bring so much to him. Why don't you do it? You, you keep walking trash about him. You go in there and knock the chip off his block. I don't have to. He's got two other people in there that want to do the same thing. And here comes Rax. So right now we got, oh, well, someone just got spit at. He got Buck to Ross on one team with freaking Flax and the pure. Oh, snap man. With pure freaking champion, Andreas Race versus Arkham. Alex Jason, Mr. WAW himself. Don't call him that. Don't call him of that. Of course I'm going to call no, him do that. Not call him. He does not deserve that title. Yes, he does. No, he doesn't. Why not? Because, I'm sorry, does he stand for WAW? Does he stand for the fans? Does he stand for his former friend? No, no, no. no. It's all about Chris Shady these exactly. days. Exactly. WAW stands for Chris Shady. No, it doesn't. It does. And it doesn't stand for We Are White either. I don't really got that. I, I gave him that. I, that. That's a good point right there. What does WAW stand for? And, and uh... Oh, well, wait a minute. Here, a hip toss. Taking down Shady. And Andreas Reyes. Oh, short neck break right there. Beautiful float over. Moving why he deserves that title coming in. Here we go. Well, see, you know why you kids. Tag rules here. Tag rules of Apocalypse. The difference is you're going to have. Oh, oh. oh. Soup play right there. Beautifully executed. And one, two. Nope, not enough. <laughs> Unlike tonight, you're going to have next side uh, Apocalypse. You're going to have pure title rules. That means you're not going to be able to go up to no man's lane. You're going to have a 10 count to get back in the ring. You got There is no, there is the tagless rule in effect. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I love this part. Hold on. And cross the streams. Well, bad things happen. Unfortunately, they happen to Mr. Shady. Yep. One, two. Nope. Alex Chase kicking up. They have not for wanted to walk in it with a loss. For so, for so long, he used that move. Now he's on the receiving end. And here we go. Whoop. Nope. No toss salad. Shady and a vegetarian. Ta tagging in Arkham. With authority right there. Those two don't like each other. No, not particularly. That kind of funny and Alex Chase, guy. he doesn't like anyone. Oh, I thought you were talking about Arkham and, pot and uh, Flax. No, they do. I mask I envy or something? I don't know. I don't really know. I, I don't like mask wrestlers. They kind of creep me out. Now Arkham definitely a creepy individual, done well, but Johnny Psycho now gone, he still wants that title, and off the ropes, Flax yeah. coming in, nope, shoulder, shoulder goes man. nowhere, nope, doesn't oh. get anywhere that way, wait a minute, oh, DPH, I kind of saw Flax. that coming, look, I got him saying it, like I said, headlock, you know, Flax uh, is doing our job here, no kidding, He's doing better than you, too. Hey, leave the job to us, Flex. No, no, Flex, come down to the table. 
I need I need some help down here. However, off the right and no, still in the headlock. Well, he's trying to Arkham trying to fight him off. Oh, big forearms to the kidneys, right back and into it. There's the reversal. Headlock. How is he cheating? I didn't say he was cheating. I said that that he reversed it. Oh no, Flax said he was cheating. I want to oh, know how. What okay. did he grab him by the horns? Uh, it makes him horny. That's wrong. Off the rope. Oh, there's the that shoulder. That's how there. it's done. Up and over. Off the Down ropes. and under. Big frog. And goes for the monkey flip. There it is. Lands hard on the tailbone. Now again, Arkham. Hold on. One, two. two. Nope. Arkham again, one of our up and coming rookies. I'm not going to take anything away from him, but again, Flax, a veteran who knows how to get in your head, knows how to make you make that one mistake. Hey, no way, man. Yeah, and Das Boot. There, there it is. Man, and man. Arkham, one, two. two. Alex Jace. Ooh, stiff kick by Alex Jace, saving his partner for the moment anyway. That's right, Apocalypse. These men are going to be facing each other, aren't they? It is. Oh, wait a minute. You know what this is right here? That's one clothesline. Up. Uh, that's two. And oh, he stops at two. And putting Das Boot to good work. And Buckter Ross on fire. Now again, Buckter Ross, I hate to say it, is kind of the odd man out in this group. A lot of experience, a lot of power. Buckter Ross hasn't lost a match in three weeks. And oh, now this oh, might be his first. Here we go. Arkham. Oh, oh, oh. beautifully scouted right there. That's why you should wear knee pads. Uh, the lesson Arkham's probably running right now. Buck to Ross choking him out. He has still five. Buck to Ross. And oh, nope. this is the paintbrush outside the ring. Is that what he calls that? It is the paint. No, that's just what it is called. It's a paintbrush. That's oh, a baseball okay. slide right there. Tagless rule brings in freaking flax. And Arkham, unfortunately, he's taking a little bit more abuse, but he's getting some head of steam. I'm try oh, wow. Wait. Not sure what that was. Off the ropes. Wait a minute. He's going. He calls oh, God. Halloween. The short cutter, one, one two. two. No, and Flax kicks out. Good God, the kids move, kid move so fast that it barely saw him pull that one off. And Flax, I think, head left a dent in the ring. How are the fans getting behind Flax now? Trying to get him to get that tag. Arkham teasing him. Oh no. Oh, this is gonna suck. Snake eyes. Ooh, on the bottom turnbuckle, a javelin snake eyes right there. Freaking Flax. Shady getting in some kicks. Wait, one, one two. two. Freaking nope, Flax the in the wrong side of town, on the wrong side of tracks where you don't yeah, want to no be. Yeah, no kidding. You got a wannabe white rapper. You got a guy with a bad attitude. You got a freak show. Let's go, Flax. Let's go, Flax. Oh, God. Let's go, Flax. Alex Chase now, that power, that experience, knows how to make you hurt. Flax, I think, is out cold. Flax is getting beat with his own arm, the 12 to 6 elbow. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, God. Oh, no. I hate it when he moves slow. The methodical cerebral movement of Alex Chase. Off the ropes. And oh, wait a minute. Wait a oh, oh, awful, awful. No, that's a back tilt the wall back breaker. When did it not be? When did it not become an awful waffle? Awful waffle is a butterfly hook. Oh, that was a tilt the world backbreaker. Okay. Oh, either way, Flax goes down on the knee and gets another shot from Alex Jace. One, two, no. I don't know what Flax has got left at this point. He's taking a pretty big beating from both Arkham and Alex Jace. Alex Jace. And these fans showing no love for Mr. Quote Unquote WAW. Mr. Demi, oh wait a minute. Oh, there it is. Inverted sharpshooter. Instead of the legs, he uses the arms here. And this flags. is a painful move, works on the neck, There's the back, the arms, everything. And no place to go. Pink it to the ropes. Can he even tap? That'd be my question. He can still talk. I think freaking Flax. And Shady, I think, taking a few shots on Flax's ass. And there's Arkham. That, what did you just... Never mind. That's just wrong. Right, oh, right, 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 ropes. Arkham breaks it up. Staples breaks up the double X. And oh, wait a minute. Staples, you mean you know, Now no this is an awful waffle. Oh, God. Butterfly backbreaker, awful waffle, beautifully executed. Well, unfortunately, Flax is now taking a lot of abuse, but again, this is where you gotta watch him. This is where he makes you make that one mistake. 
Sets him up on the knee. Oh, God. Wait a minute. Oh. Shady going up top. And upstairs. Oh, leg TNT drop. leg drop off the bottom rope. And this could be it. One, One two. two. No. Oh. oh, my God. How did he get up from that? Well, his shoulder extended up and he kicked out. Thank you, Captain Obvious. You'll make lieutenant one day. Hey, hey, hey. I told you earlier, man. It's Admiral Sarcasm. Well, no sarcasm about fans. Get behind Flex. Shady now working him into the corner. Incoming. Telegraphs the leg, though. And there we go. Oh, God. Flapjack right there to freaking Flex. Somebody call animal control. That's it. That's it. There's nothing left. One, two. No! Two and like seven tenths. Yeah, someone needs to call animal control and put Flax out of his misery. Where's Dr. Kevorkian when you need him? I think he's dead now, actually. Yeah, he had a heart attack. Ironic. That's the clothesline. Here we go. Ducks Momentum going up. And Dumb. incoming! Hits each other hard, goes down. That's the problem when you got two guys who know each other so well. Oh, you get that much momentum, you get everybody moving that fast. A collision is bound to happen, both men down. Oh, both trying to get in the corner. Shady, I think a little punch drunk, going to the wrong corner. Hurricane meets a tornado, nobody wins right there. Freaking Flex desperately needs to make a tag more than Shady. If he gets Reyes, if he gets Buck, that saves his goat ass. That saves his team, maybe even a loss right there. Flex. Can he do it? Flex. Can he do it? Hot tag. It's Here comes tag. Reyes. There's Andreas right now. And Shady, no. Big short arm clothesline. Poor, oh, big Reyes. shoulder block. Clean in house. Oh, flying shoulder oh, block. Oh, God. Take it what the bounce out of his boots for that one. Reyes proving why he deserves that title. Shady, still the legal man. Wait, Shady, though, has him up in the fireman's carry. Oh, no. Oh, GTS oh. right there. And hold on, Buck now. Das boot. Das boot. Jay's taking out Buck's knee, though. Oh, Jay, Buck tried to get out. Oh, short STO right there. And Team or Flax down two members. Shot. Flax trying to get it going Wait, again. Going again. Alex Jace has got a solid toss by freaking Flax. But hey, wait a minute, here's Arkham. Has him in the clutch. Oh. And Reyes, though. Andreas out of nowhere. Wait a minute. El Rudo on Arco. This could be it. One, two, three. Pure champion walks out with a big win. Well, regardless of a victory, these men are going to face each other at Apocalypse. So enjoy the camaraderie. Wall and last. He is very nice. Well, there you have it. Your pure champion with his buddies now. We come two weeks. Those two men with the other three. Don't touch the book. Don't touch the book, Buck. Don't touch the book.